<laughs> it worked. He didn't see us. Sorry I'm late, Daphne, but work has been insanely busy. In fact, ladder sales are climbing through the roof. <laughs> mm. Ooh, what'd you order for me? I'm starved. Mm. 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 Are you gonna order anything? <sighs> Daphne, you're never gonna believe what happened. I can't wait to hear all about it. Let's go. Uh, rung here. Hey, you must be rung. Wow, cool Aska. What's your neck size? I'm a 16 and a half, but sometimes it swells out to a 19 when it's humid. Uh... That's great. Uh, Daphne, shouldn't we be getting back to dinner? Uh, sorry, Rung, but something more important has come up. <sighs> Fine. Uh, oops. Yeah, I forgot my wallet. Daphne? By the way, I'm a big fan of your product. A sturdy ladder is hard to find these days. Oh, well, thanks. I agree. And FYI, my neck's a 16 and a half, too. And yeah, sometimes it swells. Really? Yeah. Hold on. There. Hey, that looks pretty good on you. You are so right. Here, take mine. But Fred told me he never takes off his lucky ascot. Yikes, what's this? Like far out. It's like some kind of freaky letter, man. I have a feeling I know who it's from. And it's not the warm and fuzzy kind of feeling. everyone. This is Mr. E. Mr. E! Uh, like the last time we heard from this dude, he told us we were doomed. <laughs> if you want to solve the mystery, you need to follow the fog. Remember, Crystal can't open doors like a diamond. Talk soon. That either means absolutely nothing, or it's a clue. But how do we even know we can trust Mr. E? For all we know, he could be the ghost trucker. Don't worry, Daff. I wouldn't let anything happen to you. You wouldn't, Fred? Of course not. I wouldn't let anything happen to any of my pals. You're all the same in my eyes. Whether we can trust Mr. E or not, a lead's a lead. And we need to follow it. Hey, get a load of this.